I've been spending a lot of time lately helping clients make the case for why their organizations should do information right and do it right now. In that vein, I recently posted why I believe the current uncertain economy makes this the perfect time to embark down this path, especially for retailers, though the point is the same everywhere. I've put a link to that post in the notes below. What I'd like to do now is follow up with a point to ponder about how to go about capturing everyone's attention. It's all based on the notion of table stakes. As a phrase, table stakes refers to the amount of money you have on the table to bet with when playing a gambling game, meaning you can't reach for your wallet or into your pocket for more if you need it to finish the hand. Oddly enough, the term is apropos for information governance as well, where you'll typically have one chance to convince whomever that IG makes good business sense and basically no opportunity to add additional collateral. What this means is you have to have thought carefully about how to approach the other people at the table, be they your colleagues, your immediate bosses, your senior executives, whoever, in terms of how best to elicit the reaction you're hoping for. A workshop I ran a bit ago resulted in a list of hot-button issues you may want to address as you make your play, including security, privacy, internal pain like broken processes and what my peeps called bent technology, vendor portability, migration, and always competitive advantage. Which ones you lead with and in what order depends on what role you play in the organization, so there's no cookie-cutter strategy to follow here. But what is universal is to articulate these in as concrete terms as possible, assigning costs and benefits as precisely as you can to move the needle from wouldn't it be nice to we need to do this now. Making the case for doing information right has always been one of the thorniest information challenges, something that was confirmed in so many words during a CEO Insights panel at the last InfoGov Day proceedings. And rarely has it been so critical to kicking off, accelerating, or expanding your program than it is today. So let me conclude here by urging you to put this at the top of your thinking list, and doing so without delay. And as is my custom, let me ask you this one thing. How can I help? This has been A Point to Ponder with Steve Weissman, The InfoGov Guy, a Holic Group production.